Mellow background music and no artificial lighting. A deliberately peaceful atmosphere to help pupils learn in a calm environment. So double three makes what? Six. Well done. Hawkswood is a pupil referral unit for primary school aged children, meaning youngsters aged between 4 and 11 are being excluded from mainstream education. These children aren't bad children, these are children with unmet needs and because their needs are unmet that's where the behaviour comes from. So behaviour is communication and they're communicating that they have a need that has not yet been met. That's correct. Well done. Seven-year-old Alfie has thrived since he's been at the school and now enjoys learning. He does computers, um, outside football, arts and crafts, lots of stuff. This is Kyron's second stint at Hawkswood. He was first excluded from mainstream education when he was six, but now, four years later, he recognises where he was going wrong. I was always used to get into fights. I um, always used to get excluded, but if I ever went back to my mainstream, they would never see that repeat of that behaviour. Yeah, he, he's really good. Yeah. Keisha McLeod knows more than most what can go wrong when a child is excluded from school. Her 14-year-old son, Corey Jr. Davis, was shot dead in Newham in 2017. He'd been excluded a year earlier. Corey had an attention deficit disorder which wasn't being addressed and there wasn't a unit like Hawkswood available. If he had support, he would be here, he could still be here today. It was all about the prevention rather than actually looking at him. A child's needs it needs to be met. If they're special needs, if they're educational needs, this is the place where it's supposed to happen. It's supposed to happen in schools. One in every 116 pupils in inner London boroughs are in schools for excluded students. That's compared to one in 196 nationally. The numbers are so high, a charity is trying to recruit teachers to devote themselves to the problem. We have some of the most vulnerable children at the moment falling through the gaps. And if they don't get the transformational education that they need, their life chances are incredibly bleak. But teachers can totally change what happens in that child's story. I want to be a gamer. And Chiron is proof of how much a child's life can be turned around. I don't want to be like any of these youngsters on the street. Hope for the future. It's what every child deserves. Ronke, how important is it to make sure that all children are supported, even if they've been excluded? Well, it's not rocket science, is it, to see that there's a link between the criminal justice system and children that aren't attending school. When I am in court, it could be the victims, it could be the perpetrators, but often the cases involve children that have been excluded. The best thing, obviously, would be to stop these children being excluded altogether, but if they are, then a good pupil referral unit can make all the difference. And of course, if they aren't, as we see in the case of Corey Junior Davis, then the consequences can be tragic. Okay, okay, thanks very much.